reality shows. <laughs> Would somebody out there like to tell this guy what year it is? Not that it matters now. Why don't we have a little look at his proposal? Anyone who writes in Comic Sans deserves to die. <laughs> crap, 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 crap on a cracker. I knew this was a waste of time. What you have here is your standard reality show setup, where a bunch of completely unlikable but photogenic cretins are filmed living together for a few months and blah, 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 blah. But oh wait, there's a big dark twist. There's a killer on the loose, and he's picking them off one by one. But then guess what? It's revealed they're not actually dead. It's all part of the show. And they crown the final girl the winner and everybody cries and wins a Miata and a record deal and they all go home and live happily ever after. Forget that. I've got a better idea. We'll play the Ten Little Indians routine straight. But instead of simulating the terror, why don't I slaughter these little piggies for real? You heard it here. A reality show where the contestants die. Yeah, I admit it's not the most original concept, but it's one that's fun, can be done on a budget, and would make a nice portfolio piece for those that survive the production. Chuck Barris will tell you that the ultimate TV show is one where the contestant dies at the end. So why not give the world what it's been clamoring for since the gladiatorial days? After all, television was built on a strong foundation of Schoenfreud and sadism, so we're just going to expand that to its logical conclusion. Let's get down to brass tacks. These days, any idiot with two rocks to bank together can get in on this action. It's really low in the bar. Not to mention the forms that need to be filled out, the waivers signed, the families paid off. All that red tape is enough to drive a man to murder. You can leave all that stuff to us, though. All we need from you is a little money. In fact, I'll make you a deal. Since the economy's in the toilet, and that's part of the reason that there's so much reality TV as it is, if you donate enough, I'll be willing to give you a cut of the profits. That's right, you could be making money off this thing, kids. Making money off a brutal reality show snuff film. <laughs> you people make me sick, but not as sick as this guy. He wasn't going to give you points on the gross. Oh, who's the crazy one here? Not me. Not me. If we sell enough DVDs, get distributed on Netflix, or even weasel our way into theatrical release, you can make all that money back and then some. But only if you donate. You gotta spend money to make money. Economics 101. The more people who buy it, the more money you get. If that's not enough incentive to promote the hell out of this, then I don't know what is. <laughs>